from Big Gritty Horsemanship. Um, today I want to go over some uh, do's and don'ts for tying your horse. So if I am looking for a place to tie my horse and I'm going to tie my horse somewhere over in this area, I've got a couple options. Uh, there's fence boards, there's fence posts, and there's a gate. Um, when you're tying, you always want to make sure that you're going to tie to something stable and secure. Um, something that's solid in the ground. So I wouldn't tie to the board or the um, gate just because if something were to happen, your horse could pull back. They could take either of those things with them. I would tie to the post. Um, it's stable. It's secure. It's concreted into the ground. Um, that's going to be my best option over here. Uh, when I go to tie my horse off to a post, I want to tie them about eye level and arms length away. So they have enough room where they could move around a little bit, kind of do like a 180 type of deal, um, but not enough room where they could hang a leg over it, you know, get their foot over their rope, um, get their head down too far and get themselves stuck under the rope. Um, those are just some important things. You know, you don't want to have your horse too long where it can get in trouble. You also want to be really aware of the area around where you're tying the horse. You know, are there other horses around. Um, if you're having to tie, like you're on a trail ride, you're out in the woods, is there anything your horse could hurt itself on if it moved around a little bit? You know, holes, sharp rocks, other trees, branches, things like that. Um, just to make sure that you're really aware of the area that you're tying your horse. Make sure you're always tying something stable and secure um, and that you're not tying them too long or even too short for that matter. Um, I hope those things helped you out. If you're unsure of what kind of knots to use when you're tying your horse, um, make sure you check out. We've got a few videos on different um, styles of knots that you can use to tie your horse with. Um, those are on our YouTube channel. Uh, make sure that you're subscribed to that to keep up to date with content. Um, make sure you're also checking this out on Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat. And then we'll have links to all of our social media in the video description. And don't forget about our website, www.begritty.net. Thanks for watching.